Doxa is a Greek word meaning greatness. The whole kind of ethos behind the Doxa Youth Foundation is to get kids to the bush and to provide them the same experiences and opportunities that all kids get. And we deal a lot with city kids that don't get a chance to go out to the bush. So you see them get off the bus really wide-eyed. They've never seen the bush before, so it's a really, really wonderful sort of experience to be involved with that. I'm Suzanne McDonnell. I'm the food coordinator at the Kyneton Community House. I look after all the meals, all the community meals. Uh, I'm a chef. So we've uh, recently entered into a partnership with DOXA, the youth camp out at uh, Malmesbury, and they have a whole pantry full of food that they were not able to use because of COVID. It meant the school kids couldn't do those camps anymore. DOXA very generously offered us their kitchen and all their, their food stuffs, which had a bit of a use by date on them. So we've had a wonderful time going out there and cooking up lots of meals. It's been absolutely sensational. It's a beautiful environment, but it's it feels great to know that all that food is not going to be wasted, that we're able to use it and create nutritious home-style meals for the Kyneton community. Community development is really a process of asking the community what they need and trying to pick up on their cues and then feeding back into the community what they've asked for. So our food relief has become one of the big things we've been offering through this time and it's growing exponentially. So people just have less income now and still have all the pressures of everyday life like mortgage pressures or rent pressures. So we've been making up to 100 meals a week. The partnership with DOCS has really helped us amp up that meal production without spending money that we don't have. And in return, they're getting more of a presence in the community and we're also committing to their garden program. So we've got a local woman who raises seeds for our community garden program and we're dedicating staff to come and grow the plants here, both for us at the moment, but ongoing into the future with DOXA. It's really important to have local community connection. DOXA was originally established on a volunteer principle. The whole buildings and facilities, everything here was built by volunteers. It makes you feel good. It's, it's what you want to do, be able to help. This is a really tough time for a lot of people. What I love about these sorts of programs is it takes a whole team of people to do this. They do it out of the generosity of their hearts, many of them. There's the volunteers who are just fantastic. It makes me feel great when I go home and know that I've made a bit of a difference to people's lives and uh, that's very important to me. I like that feeling. 